Central Kentucky. We've had mostly cloudy skies this afternoon. It looks to stay relatively quiet this evening. Fort Banks Skyview from EKU's campus looking nice right now. No precipitation anywhere close to us. A look here from Louisville and also some uh, steadier traffic there. May see some uh, traffic slowdowns if you have travel plans to head toward Louisville and uh, Cincinnati. That was an earlier view that you can see from about an hour ago in Cincinnati. Still showing plenty of clouds from earlier this afternoon. Live HD radar, I cannot show any precipitation, even though yeah, I know that I was talking to Tom earlier. He said he saw a couple snowflakes or flurries earlier this afternoon. Freezing cold temperatures tonight, though, so cold enough for snow. Not expected any precipitation. No snow. In fact, we'll have clearing skies overnight with lows in the upper 20s. Saturday, mostly sunny skies. A great day to be out and about. A little milder temperature wise. By Sunday, though, we'll have the chance for seeing some rain showers. We'll talk more about the timing of that rain and have a look at your extended forecast here in just a minute. But outside right now, winds are relatively light. They're about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Of course, wind direction is important this time of the year. Winds are going to turn a little bit more out of the southwest tonight into our Friday or into our Saturday. So that's going to keep our temperatures relatively mild or at least on a warming trend. As look at your wind chills, though, even with a light breeze, though, it does make it feel much colder. In fact, most of us seeing temperatures that feel more like the mid to upper 20s at this time, even though we'll see our temperatures in the lower 30s by about 8 o'clock. Overnight low temperatures, again, upper 20s. But we start off tomorrow morning with some sunshine. No real weather disturbances across the area right now to give us any issues. There's some high pressure to our west that will move back in across the region again for the start of our weekend. So from midnight into our early morning hours, clearing skies, mostly sunny to start off our day as the day goes on. Mostly sunny skies into the afternoon. Highs around 50 degrees as we head later into your afternoon hours of Saturday. Clouds move back in for Sunday morning. Cloudy start to the day. Start to see a few showers by late morning into midday with some scattered light rain possible into the afternoon. This is mainly light rain. In fact, some of us may actually miss out on the rain about a tenth of an inch or less. Highs in the upper 40s as we go into Sunday afternoon. For tonight, 28 degrees. Clouds will be on the decrease overnight with more sunshine. For the start of our weekend, highs around 50 degrees. Again, a nice start to the weekend. A little rainy for the end of the weekend, 47 degrees by your Sunday. Next week, though, we stay with a little bit of a warming trend, mid 50s, as we go into Monday and Tuesday. Could see just a few spotty showers. Overall, temperatures stay above average into the mid to late part of next week. In fact, next Thursday, our first official day of winter, we'll have a high of 55 degrees. But again, a nice start to the weekend Saturday with a high of 50. Tom and Amber? The 50s sure look good. Oh, yeah, and they're going to feel good. Yes, thank you, Jason. All right, coming up.